I never thought I would be in a situation like this, but I went through that. Like, it's really unexpected. Like, I've always wanted to do YouTube, but I wasn't going to do it, you know? Like, I didn't want to do it. It's not a game, it's a red stick. since I've sat and done a proper video like this I've been doing dance colors and music colors and I barely put a video on YouTube well that is why this video is here today I'm going to have a talk with you guys and I'm going to be updating you and man, mostly we are going to be having like a chit chat and I'm going to be updating you guys since I've never done that before in the sense I've never had like a chit chat I'm just like staying here um, the way I am at home but I'm literally wearing some bangles just to kind of spice it up even though it does nothing <laughs> anyways guys if you're new to my channel I really warmly welcome you guys and please do subscribe to cheese world and join our family that we're growing and if you haven't checked my previous video make sure you check that out the link is in the description box below I did a really different video um, like I've never done it before, done something like that. It's like a music video but a cover song which came out great. I mean it's not the best but I tried um, and hopefully there will be a BTS of what happened <laughs> behind the scenes of that video as well. If you have been part of Cheese World for a really long time, welcome back. I'm going to be updating you guys on what I've been going through. I've been mentally down, I've been so under pressure. I'll be talking about all of that and at the end of this video I'll be answering three questions that I actually asked you guys on Instagram um, to kind of ask me anything but actually three asked me questions and others were like random stuff and some bots and all that so I'll be answering those three and I'll be featuring them in this video as well at the end of this video so keep watching where should I start off with so this year obviously has been obviously has been hectic right so my second semester of my degree started and things got really different because of this pandemic we were affected a lot all of us we had so many more lecturers while the pandemic was going on which was in our first semester but when our second semester started most of our lecturers were gone they like they left uni we don't know if they were fired let's just not go over there um, but hopefully they didn't but they left because most of them were foreigners maybe they left for their you know uh, country to go home uh, probably because of that and uh, yes some really stuff bad stuff happened um, and we literally couldn't even handle that like you know obviously people come into our life and go but the thing is um, like there is we had a lot of lecturers guiding us supporting us to do stuff but there is there are like three years right i'm in my second year so there's this one lecturer and another lecturer and another lecturer what three lecturers three lecturers these three lecturers are the main three who are actually taking care of all the three years which is so damn hectic and their pressure our pressure everything is being affected like their stress is kind of affecting us i'm going to be talking in my perspective i was actually mentally down i did i just really at a point wanted to give up on what i wanted to do like i mean i would on what i was doing you know the degree i was doing i really wanted to quit but something kept uh, me <laughs> on because i shouldn't give up and my friends were like you know what just one more year you have to go keep up with this you can do this don't give up You've already paid for this whole degree, so don't give up. Just one more year and your higher education will be done, which is time flies. So there were some amazing friends who tried to motivate me, even though they were also down. They tried to motivate me and I tried to motivate them. We were like so down. We were under a lot of pressure. These online submissions and every week we have submissions and uh, everything is coming back again. We had a holiday for two weeks. And we just started university and <laughs> all of that is coming back again because we were supposed to work during the break and 
I'm very sure none of us did, except maybe one or two did, but I did nothing. Like literally nothing. <laughs> I was so like, I don't know. I was like, I don't know. I want to work. I want to be productive, but I end up doing something totally different. Something like creating a cover song or creating a dance cover or something like that. Even when it comes to YouTube, I was like uh, mentally really down. I wasn't really in a mood to sit and talk to you guys just like this. But now I'm kind of okay. Like I need to do this because this is what I love doing. And um, even though 10 people watch my videos, I really don't mind. I love creating content for you guys. So that's what I do to create your mood. And also I want to let you know, please don't give up on what you do. Because if I did have stopped my degree what the heck uh, what, what sort of stupid decision would that be like just one more year i went two and a half years and just stopping in the middle because of this huge mental breakdown that i went through no we have to fight somehow be healthy and the amazing people around you that motivated you you should you should listen to them and get to a greater point so that's what where i am now but i do know I have to face more in the future also i wanted to let you know the most biggest biggest news i'm moving out yes you heard me right i'm going to be moving out of my home for the first ever time i was a girl who had never had a sleepover at another person's place i never wasn't allowed because you know i was like you know this family girl you know my parents were too very protective my father was, uh, my mother is still obviously, but she knows I can handle things by myself. So she's letting me move out of the house for the first time and I'll be living alone for the first time. And the good news is I'll be paying every single thing. So cool, right? Like I've always wanted to, but I do know um, it's going to be a huge challenge. Um, I will be <laughs> loaded with more and more work but it's going to be amazing I, I really know that it's going to be so amazing and such a different experience yet it's going to be fun and lonely too i guess because i'll be alone <laughs> anyways um also i wanted to let you know that i am currently the content manager of two amazing artists at beauty nomad and at Devi vaginity both of them are Indian. Uh, they're just such sweethearts. Their amazing content is out there on Instagram. Please do give them a follow. I'll put their links down below and over here the names. Please do give them a follow. Like I love working with them. Because of them, I am able to pay my rent, which is so cool. So yeah, it's, that is that. And I've uh, done a few freelancing print designings for a brand, which was, I don't know if it was a great decision that I took, but it's totally fine, you know, I learn from my ups and downs. So yeah, basically that's it. And I'll be doing a moving in vlog, like, you know, all the things that I took and all that. Um, this video is literally really long, just me talking. This is why I mentioned it as a chit chat we need to talk definitely because i didn't update you guys and you know why i couldn't be you know make like make videos i was actually really really down i never thought i would be in a situation like this but i went through that like it's really unexpected so i'm going to be um giving the three shout outs uh, and also, before that, make sure you follow me on Instagram because I have dope content out there right now. So the first shout out goes to Ranudi underscore DS. So the name is right over here. Make sure you go and follow her on Instagram as well. She's such a sweetheart and she loves my work and thank you so much love for loving what I do. What she asked me was, what are the secrets behind your life goals? Well. Well, is she asking me what secrets I do to go for my life goals or what are my secret life goals? I have no idea. <laughs> but I'll just answer both probably since I just have three questions. So um, first one, I'll just break that into two questions. What are the secrets behind my life goals? 
So what I what I, I just answer the way I, I get it to my head. The secrets for my life goals are for you to reach it. Um, I'm talking about right now um, is to never ever give up, even though how hard you go down you sometimes you go up the hill and then you fall down the hill at once and you just can't even imagine oh my gosh i did not expect to be here like i wanted to be there but you go down there sometimes that happens but you should never give up what you should do is fight back it will take back take a lot more time but fight back to get to the place where you were that is the biggest secret that i have and always believe in yourself always no matter whoever say how bad you are try to drag you down always believe in yourself and do what you do and the other uh, aspect of that is secrets behind my life goals what um so i'll be answering that in another term my secrets of my life goals which i've never actually mentioned on my youtube channel or actually anywhere I think I mentioned it on Instagram. Like, I really want to become an actress. I love acting since I was really young. I want to sing. I love dancing. I love performing live on stage. By the way, I did a live performance for the first time, which was um very nerve-wracking. But make sure you go check that out. I'll leave the link down below to that as well. And, uh, okay, where was I? I always go out of the topic. <laughs> And I always, I, I'm obviously a fashion designer, so first I really want to work for a good brand and um, really gain that work experience and hopefully one day I want to have my own brand, <laughs> which is um, definitely going to be sustainability goals. Okay, so the next question is by Heshani.Y, she's a dear friend of mine. And she asked, how to start a YouTube channel, lol. Help me make one, I don't know apps to edit, etc. So, okay, to be honest, she was the one who kind of gave me this idea to make a YouTube channel. Like, I've always wanted to do YouTube, but I wasn't going to do it, you know? Like, I didn't want to do it. Like, because I was so camera shy, that's a different topic, I'll talk about that later. So she was like, we'll make a YouTube channel together. And I was like, yeah, we'll do that. And then I just wanted to give it a try and you know, I did. <laughs> and then this is how we are here today. From zero to 279 subscribers. Oh my gosh, I love you guys so much. And more than 16,000 waves, which is so dope. So, okay, so I have an actual, like a video on how I started my YouTube channel, basically like the apps and all that. Uh, I didn't have proper equipment. I didn't. I just had a, you know, camera in the sense my phone camera and the editing apps. I all mentioned that in that video. I'll mention that link down below, so you can go definitely go and check that out. And also, um, currently what I'm going, what I'm using is my iPhone camera and my laptop. Uh, I'm using a MacBook, so I'm using iMovies to edit all my videos, which is so easier compared to what happened probably like a year ago <laughs> it took so much time and it was so hard to kind of save the stuff that i was doing who's your favorite music artist okay so uh i can't remember her name <clears throat> so it's at j x n x t h x k i'm so sorry i forgot your name Okay, so my favorite artist currently is Raja Kumari and um, who has been inspiring me since I was young was Katy Perry but my favorite artist at the moment is Raja Kumari. She is a Raja Kumari. <laughs> Anyways, that's it for this video you guys and I'm so excited to move in both scared and nervous. Um, but let's see how it goes and I'll be doing daily vlogs because I'll be living alone mainly and I'll be obviously bored and I will have much more time for you guys because the traveling the traveling times get cut off my life so which is so cool but see how it goes anyways thank you so much for tuning in guys and if you were staying until the end of this video and watching me blabber like the whole video this is basically that's what is this video is 
we needed to talk. So yeah, it's a boring video, but I, I thought of talking to you guys because I didn't really talk to you guys. Anyways, I love you all so much. Stay safe, stay strong, never give up in what you do. I love you all so much. And don't forget to follow me on Instagram. See you guys in my next video. Bye.